What's good, family? We back with another one. And on this one, they say Lil Dirt taking shots at FBG Duck, Quando Rondo, uh, Lil Tim, NBA Young Boy. Okay, so now look, the name of the song is called Still Running with Lil Baby and Meek Mill. And they saying that Dirt is taking shots at these different people. Now, my whole thing is this. Dirk then already came out and said that he ain't saying that he ain't saying no names and before that he said he not even dissing the ops no more. Right? So he had to rap a certain way. Let y'all figure it out. He ain't gonna say their names because he don't want to get them no clout. See, a lot of people thinking, assuming. Okay, so for instance, let's take why FBG Duck was alive. He not here no more. Now, a whole lot of people saying that when Duck was alive, Dirk ain't never say his name. That's not the case, and that's not true. Dirk has dissed his ops on, if you go back to his old music, or that, he, he used to do that. But the thing is, the bigger dirt got, the less he would talk about these dudes and the less the less he would speak on them, he would just say it in a certain way to make you get it. Because he didn't want them to come up off of that. If you are already starting to come up and I shine your and I put your name in the night light like that, it's gonna be easy for you to come up. So I'm not finna do that. So that's the situation. With Duck. So, Le Dirk, Le Dirk ain't gonna never try to say his name. I know he did it in the one, but it's like he gone now. Yeah, so it wouldn't even matter when he said the little has, who has Duck line or whatever like that. So, that's understandable. But, like on this song, okay, with Quando Rondo, y'all know what happened between him and Vaughn. Why wouldn't Dirk say something about that? You know, Quando Rondo affiliated with. NBA young boy, why wouldn't Dirk address that? I don't get it. It's like Dirk do something now when people like they act so surprised. Dirk been dissing his like his whole life. That's how I can tell a lot of y'all just came around and y'all went back like when this stuff first started. Cause Dirk was Dirk was really out there in the field getting caught with guns, getting caught like this is all documented. Go back to his mixtapes like. He didn't care, but when he got bigger, he smartened up, and he got smart enough to know. It's like, no, if this dude already got a buzz, and I say his name, he then he gonna instantly shoot up to me where I'm at. I'm not finna do that. He used to diss him on Twitter all the time. He stopped doing that. Like, so, you know, with the Quando Rondo situation, he didn't express how he felt about that too many times. You know, with the whole NBA young boy and all, and what they did to Vaughn. So, you know, that that's weighing on him. That's carry that's gonna carry on him. So quite often, yeah, he gonna mention it. He gonna bring that up. Like, he gonna speak on that. Because if you in a booth and your music is real, you gonna rap what's getting to you. Like you gonna get your feelings. Like, so he gonna say something. But he don't wanna flat out just say the names. Because he trying to be discreet about the situation. Y'all know the boys on everything. They watching everything. They doing everything. They're trying to be discreet with the situation. You know what I'm saying? As far as him dissing Wooski and Lil Tim, he probably feels certain ways about them too. But at the same time, Wooski was next to the hottest since Duck, like, when Duck passed away, he was the only one shooting up. So, Dirk ain't going to bring nobody up like that. You see, Dirk and Ruger just had that inboxing match, and Dirk told Ruger, I don't even know you. That simple. Even if he did know him or heard him before or whatever, he just flat out told the man, I don't know you. You know what I'm saying? Got Ruger out here looking like he trying to clout chase off Dirk. 
and then Ruger put the messages out. See what I'm saying? So it's like you got to understand how dirt moving, and you got to understand that these things gonna be spoke on, whether people like it or not. But dirt gonna address it in his way, cause that's what he want to do, and that's how he want to keep it. So y'all can beef with each other back and forth all day, do diss songs about each other back and forth all day. Dirt got real stuff to do. When you seen him do that song with Drake, you should have known that he was going to get busy and he still got stuff to do. And even with all the stuff he got to do, he still be trying to bring members up from the hood. He still be trying to bring OTF up. He still try to have OTF shine just like he shine. He still try to have money in their pocket. You feel me? So he don't got time to be, he know if he do like the situation he in, the spots he in right now, if he come flat out and just be like, Quando Rondo, an NBA young boy. That'll put a halt on everything he got going on because it's like he a stamp it, he stamping it. He officially said it. Not every interview he gotta go to, people wanna know about him and NBA young boy. People wanna know how he feel about Quando Rondo. Who wanna keep hearing that in their interviews? You can't do that. When you reach a certain level, you got to move different. So did he diss him? Oh, he dissed him for sure though. You know? <laughs> he yeah, he he dissed him for sure, but he had to do it a certain way. He not trying to let them cut up off of him. Like, Dirk, Dirk smarter than that. Like, he moving the right way, doing what he's supposed to be doing. He moving like he's supposed to move. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all already know, family. Get in the comment box. Let me know what y'all think about Dirk dissing them on that song. Also, check out the playlist for videos you haven't missed. Make sure you hit that bell so you get and see all the videos. And I'm out, family. I'm going to see y'all on the next video.